Hey, it's Ronin. One of my students sent me a request saying, how do I play this little light of mine in a Cajun Zydeco style? I just had to listen to it and this is an answer for that student, but let me explain the concept behind how we learn a song in a specific style. So I'm gonna, I'm showing my screen. Let me, let's listen to Chicken Dance Boy uh, play this on accordion. Good, so it's this little light of mine with that Cajun Zydeco groove to it. So, to my student, he's playing it in C major. What I did there was a C major triad. Good. So, step one, we need to know how to play this little light of mine. Pull up the sheet music, figure it out by ear. It's not a difficult song. In C major, so step one, you have to know how to play the song in a straight way, not in a zydeco, not in a waltz, just what are the notes of, a, of the song. In C major, the first note will either be C, E, or G, likely. No, no, yes. Right? Then I believe it goes to an F or a G. It goes to an F. Back to C. So again, step one, pull up the sheet music, pull up some sort of chord chart or some sort of book that contains the, the chords and figure out the melody. This is not a difficult song. The chords are C, F, G, right? Playing the song. G, F, C. Little variations on the voicing. Good. You have to know how to play that song in a straight way. Just with a simple oompa. Without pausing, without hesitation, in a simple way, in a boring way. Step two, I have a lesson about three different levels of melody. First level is with one finger. Level two is multi-fingered melodies. We're starting to complete the chord. Because it's in C major, I could start playing the rest of the notes. We said F. That's level two playing. It starts to sound richer. Right, let's switch to. Still just playing the melody in a straight way. Let me listen to the real thing. S level three melody, which is what this chicken dance boy is doing, is playing the melody up at the top um, and underneath you're playing level two melody. So it's level one on top and underneath it we're playing that right so I'm playing the chords of the song under the melody and playing them with some rhythm. And here we're doing these Cajun Zydeco licks. That's 
what our right hand is doing. Our left hand, again, we have to know when the chord changes are. So we start off easy. Ba, ba, da, 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 ba. Oompa, oompa, oompa. Next, we're starting to play a bit more of that zydeco, uh, zydeco Cajun rhythm. <laughs> I'm using an alternate bass technique. And again, I would follow along the chords in the song. There are just three of them. Let's listen to exactly what this person is doing, but everyone's take on this kind of rhythm will be their own. So when you get comfortable with those chords, those chord shapes and voicings and moving around like that, it is my 15 minutes of practice, really. It's going like this with your C major, going like that with your F major. Those are the chords of the song. Going like that with the G major, back to C major your trides and arpeggios. And really that's how the song works, right? There's my C major. There's my F major. There's my C major G. So, so really those are the foundation. Those are the building blocks to both Zydeco Cajun music to any kind of songs. Cause that gives you the liberty to start doing uh, this little light of mine waltz. this little out of mind tango, whatever it is, it's it's getting those building blocks. So to read the student's email, um, will you need sheet music? It helps to know the chords. Is there any sheet music 100%? And is there an easy way to learn? Really, it's the same way that we learn any, any of our songs. We learn the chords of the song. In this case, there are three, C, F, and G. We learn to switch between them. We sing along to the song, right? I'll link to my blog post about how to learn a song. Um, and then we slowly progress it to a style like Zydeco or like a waltz or a tango. But at the heart of it is just learning to do. All the stuff in between is just a C major. Yeah. Anyways, I hope that helps. Let me know if you have any questions. Enjoy.